slot machines have been called the crack cocaine of gambling, uh, electronic morphine. The pokey machine is the evil genius, or the person who created the pokey machine. The heart of a game is math. That's our product. I have such pity for the people that play them because I des I've designed hundreds of these games. I tend to think of the games as like little movies. You just have one scene, though, that kind of plays over and over again. These incredibly complex machines where you don't really know if you're winning. There needs to be something that pulls them to the machine, and that's what the graphics are. I really, you know, like a strong pair of eyes. You don't want them to become too mindful, and they keep plugging away. Those machines are so powerfully built that they're built for addiction. If you stimulate the dopamine neurons, you're already halfway into the direction of addiction. What other things besides drugs might turn on this system? Could we see the system turn on in a game of chance? Suddenly the neurons were going wild. You're like a rat that's sitting there key pressing to get a little jolt of electricity in your reward system. I consented to, to playing. I didn't consent to unlawful hypnotism. The house will win. There's no chance. It's just built that way.